Hi guys, Mr. Rice here, and we're going to make a small space shooter uh, sprite that moves across the screen to the left and right, similar to like a Galaxian type game. Um, if we're not gonna make a full game here, we're just going to learn how the spaceship moves left and right, uh, kind of something like this. You see, all we do is we have a space shooter at the bottom. If I move left on the joystick, he moves to the left. And if I move right on the joystick, he moves to the right. This is an old arcade game uh, called Galaxian, came out in 1979. Uh, and Galaxian has a little galaxy, that's what they call the spaceships at the bottom of your screen. And you'll notice at the top of the screen, there are aliens that are trying to destroy your spaceship that you have to shoot. And if you clear all the aliens from your spaceship, uh, you've cleared the level and can move on to the next one. Okay, so in your Make Code Arcade, click on New Project, and we'll call this Galaxy Space Ship, something like that. Okay, and click Create. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to add a sprite for our spaceship. So to add a sprite, click on the Sprites Toolbox. We're going to do set my sprite to. We're going to rename. Here, let me do that a little bit. That's better. We're going to rename my sprite as spaceship. It's always good to give your sprites and variables names of what they are. Uh, and then you can draw your sprite right here. I'm going to be a little lazy and pick something from the gallery, uh, so I don't have to waste your time uh, while I draw something. Also, I'm not very good at drawing. So these kind of look like spaceships. So I'm gonna pick that green one right there. Perfect. All right, so the, you'll see my spaceship load in the center of the screen. But to be a true Galaxian game, we need our spaceship to be at the bottom of the screen. So let's set the position of our spaceship along the bottom. So click on sprites, look for the block that says set my sprite position to. Go ahead and drag it into on start. All right, uh, you notice you get an error because it says my sprite and it should say spaceship. There is no my sprite anymore. We renamed it. All right, now we're good. And the position X0, Y0 is up in the corner. So let's pick the correct position somewhere at the bottom of our screen there. I'm just gonna put them in the bottom and the center. That looks good. And you can play with those numbers. I used the little coordinate thing to pick a position, but you can adjust the numbers by typing them in as well. Okay, good. So now my spaceship's at the bottom of my screen. Uh, now let's make him move. Now there's a few ways to make him move. Uh, you will you can play with some of the blocks in the controller toolbox. We're going to use this first one that says move my sprite with buttons. So let's go ahead and drag that block into our on start. Make sure to change the variable name to spaceship. Okay, now notice if I use my little controller here, I can also use my keyboard arrow keys, so I'll do those. I can move my spaceship around the screen. Uh, but to be a true Galaxian game, he should only be able to move left and right. So we can adjust that setting by clicking on the little plus button and notice it says VX100, VY100. So that means I can move my sprite 100 pixels per second in the X axis and in the Y axis. I don't want to move in the Y axis, that's up and down. So I'm going to put this number to zero, the VY number. So now he can still move left and right, but if I click up and down, he's not moving up and down at all. You can only move left and right, that's good. Now, the last problem uh, is your sprite can move off the screen. And Galaxian Games, your sprites should not be able to move off the screen and disappear like that. So let's add a block that says stay in screen. That block is found in the sprites toolbox. Scroll down into the effects category and notice one block says set my sprite stay in screen on. So we'll add that block, change it to spaceship.
And now my spaceship can no longer leave the screen. Perfect. Now, like I said, this is not a very fully fledged game. Uh, you can add some features to this to make it look more like a spaceship game. Like if you click on scene, maybe let's add a little star field effect. In the effects category, we'll start screen effect, uh, star field. Now it kind of looks like your spaceship is flying through space. Uh, this doesn't actually do anything to the game, but it's kind of a fun little effect. We're not going to add any space aliens or be able to shoot anything today. That'll come in later lessons. But for now, we just have a little spaceship that moves left and right on the screen. Isn't that nice? So that should help you make your own little Galaxy spaceship uh, to start a game out. Like I said, we'll be adding more features, uh, things that you can shoot uh, to make the game a little more fun. Because right now, it's not really a game. You can just move a little sprite around the screen. Okay, so stay tuned for more tutorials, and I'll see you later.